Right, thank you so much, Akisa Andrea, for that story. Now, I'd like us to head back to the corridors of justice, Milimani Law Courts, that houses the anti-corruption court, where former sports cabinet secretary Hassan Rio is already in court, and uh, he's said to appear before the... Uh, Chief Magistrate, that is Douglas Ogote, when it comes uh, to uh, corruption in connection uh, to the 2016 Rio Olympics uh, Games scandal. Now, the duo, that is, of course, Hassan Rio and Kipchoge Keino, spent the better part of Thursday, that is yesterday, at the Directorate of Criminal Investigations being grilled. Let's cross over and listen to the court case which has begun. Between 30 March 2016 and 25 August 2016, as the Minister of Sports, Culture and the Arts Office within Nairobi County, being the Cabinet Secretary of the State Ministry, used your office to properly conquer a benefit of Kenya Shimon, 918,391, to Richard Agura by including him into the Rio 2016 Olympic Games Kenyan delegation team to travel to Brazil and ask that the resulted to the loss of public funds. True or not true? No true, Your Honor. Count number four is for Hassan Wario Arero. The charge is abuse of Section one of the Anti-Corruption and Economic Crimes Act number three of 2008. The particulars are that between 30th March 2016 and 25th August 2016, at the Minister of Sports, Culture and the Arts Office, the Nairobi County, being the Cabinet Secretary of the State Ministry, used your office to improperly conquer a benefit of Kenya Shield is 918,391. To Monica Mikina Sairo by including him to the Rio 2016 Olympic Games Kenyan delegation team to travel to Brazil and act that resulted in the loss of public funds. Two or not two? Not two. Count number five, the charge is for Hassan Wario Arero. The, the, the charge is abuse of office contrary to section 46 and swear with section 48, subsection 1. The Anti Corruption and Crime Act number 3 of 2003. The particulars are between 30th March 2016 and 25th August 2016, at the Minister of Sports, Culture and the Arts Offices within Nairobi County, being the Cabinet Secretary of the State Ministry, used your office to improperly confer a benefit of 493,391. To one million to reach by including him into the Rio 2016 Olympic Games Kenyan delegation team to travel to Brazil and ask that resulted to the loss of public funds. Two or not two? Yes, we are. Count number six, the charge is abuse of office. The charge is for Hassan Wario Arero. The charge is abuse of office, contrary to section 46 as well as section 48, subsection 1 of the the particular uh, that that in March 2016 and 25th August 2016, at the Minister of Sports, Culture and the Arts Offices within Nairobi County, being the Cabinet Secretary of the State Ministry, used your office to improperly confer a benefit of Kenya Shibu's 498,391 to Samuel Dubuna by including him into the Rio 2016 Olympic Games Kenya delegation team to travel to Brazil and have a the Two or not two? Not two, Your Honor. Yeah. Count number nine. It's for Harold Komenchele. The charge is the use of office contrary to section 46 as well as section 48 and section 1 for the Anti-Corruption and Economic Crimes Act No. 3 of 2003. The particulars are, are, are that on the 19th day of January, July 2016, the Minister of Sports, Culture and the Arts Office within Nairobi County, being the Director of Administration of the State Ministry, used your office to improperly confer a benefit for Kenya to the six million five hundred and ninety two hundred and fifty six in payment.
payment of air tickets and allowances to unauthorized persons during the Rio 2016 Olympic Games 2016. So, we're not so. Count number 10 for Aaron Comenchebet. The charge is willful failure to comply with applicable procedures and guidelines relating to management of public funds contrary to Section 48 and Section 2B as well as Section 48 and Section 1 of the Anti-Corruption and Economic Crimes Act number 3 of 2003. The particulars are that on 19 May 2016, at the Ministry of Courts, Culture and the Arts offices within Nairobi County, being the Director of Administration of the same Ministry, being a person whose functions concern the management, the management of public property, carelessly fails to comply with the applicable law and procedures relating to the management of public funds, to which Section 68, Subsection 1, A, and B of the Public Management Act 24 by, by unlawfully authorizing payment in excess of US dollar 151, 500, that is Kenya shillings, 15 million, 907, 500, as allowances to the members of the Kenyan team to the real 2016 Olympic Games. True or not true? Count number 11 is for Harold Comenchele. The charge is engaging in a project without prior planning contrary to section 45, subsection 2C, as well as section 48, subsection 1, for the Anticorruption and Economic Crimes Act number 3 of 2003. The particulars are that between the 30th March 2016 and the 5th August 2016, at the Ministry of Sports, Culture and the Arts Offices within Nairobi County, being the, within Nairobi County, being the Principal Secretary and the Director Administration, respectively, being persons whose functions con concern management of public funds, procured air tickets without proper proper planning. Not true, Your Honor. Number 15 is for Patrick to Matthew Thomas. The charge is will be here to comply with the applicable procedures and guidelines relating to management of public funds contrary to section 45, subsection 2B, as well as section 48, subsection 1 of the Anti-Corruption and Economic Crimes Act number 3 of 2003. The particulars are that on 19th day of July 2016, the Ministry of Sports, Culture and the Arts within Nairobi County, being the finance officer of the said ministry, being a person whose functions concerned the management of public property, carelessly failed to comply with the applicable law and procedures relating to the management of public funds with section, sub, sub, section 68, subsection 1A and B of the Public, public Financial Management Act 2012 by carelessly misusing public funds amounting to Kenya shillings 22 million in a manner which was uneconomical and ineffective during the Rio 2016 Olympic Games. Two or not two? So I've entered pleas of not guilty. Yes? Your Honor, when you appeared before you on Monday the 15th, the court gave 
directions and as far as the first accused is concerned, uh, more particularly to appear before the DCA at 6 o'clock yesterday <coughs> the process of the process of one to be found in the first accused in the process. Right, there you have it, former Sports Cabinet Secretary Hassan Wario appearing before Chief Magistrate Douglas Ogote of a misappropriation of 55 million shillings during the 2016 Rio Olympics that saw the government lose lots of money. And of course, um, the court case is still underway and uh, we shall continue bringing you the latest details as to what transpires in the corridors of justice. And of course, just remind, we have a reporter reading court, Timothy 